For the students at Ringwater Middle School, education means being healthy and getting active. So today you uh, witnessed our students out doing um, part of our walking club that we have here at Ring Lardner Middle School. Um, uh, I believe Evan talked about our grant that we received for this thing, uh, for the walking club. So, um, you know, uh, we want to get our students out, getting active. Um, ironically, we started it um, around our testing season. So when our students were taking MSTEP and PSATs, um, we decided to implement the, the walking club because we've found a lot of research that says, you know, 20 to 30 minutes of walking a day gets your brain ready to learn and ready to perform at its best. Um, you know, Evan had a great picture of a, of a brain at rest and a brain after it's had a, like 20 to 30 minutes of, of, of walking and it shows uh, all the neurons and everything that are firing in the brain, getting kids ready to learn uh, and perform. So we decided to, to go ahead and implement that and we've been doing it uh, classes walk twice a week um, for 20 to 30 minutes and it's, it's been almost a norm here at the building now. So kind of the last three years we've been really focused on uh, educating the whole child here at Ring Lardner. So we've been looking for opportunities to any way to include nutrition education, um, health education, social emotional education. So the big thing is um, we got an ISEP grant last year that kind of led into opportunities where I get a lot of emails about different kind of grants that there's, there are out there and so one of them is the Building Healthy Communities grant and uh, applied for this last August and then um, we received um, this walking grant so we could do the walking club. Um, it's, it's a 10 week period where we have to walk you know at least 40, 40 minutes a week um, and so we're doing it school wide instead of just having a walking club after school because we want, we want everyone to be involved um, in the walking club. So. That's how we got the grant. Students were a little hesitant at first, um, but it seems like they really seem to enjoy it. It gives them an opportunity to get out, maybe socialize a little bit with their friends while doing um, a physical activity. So um, a lot of kids say it wakes them up in the morning if they're, if they're morning or it gets them refocused um, if they're an afternoon um, group. Ring Lardner has invested a lot into its new health initiative, including rewarding students for being active and even introducing the students to healthy snack alternatives. We got $2,000. Um, we got the Sparky, the monitor, and all the tags and the bracelets so that when they walk we can calculate the laps. We're doing a little competition with the classes, um, so we're going to have a prize at the end for the class for each grade level that walks the most laps. Everyone's walking two times a week, at least three times a week. Um, and then we also, with that grant, with the Building Health Community Grant, we also had a um, healthy snacks grant, so we were able to do some taste testing and stuff in the cafeteria. So we're, you know, we're just trying to do as best we can to try to get our kids active and um, ready to learn. Evan got, a, got the grant for us, um, the Healthy Building Healthy Communities grant, and um, you know, we did, like I said, did a lot of research on, on the benefits of getting kids active, and we figured that um, you know, through the equipment that was provided to us, we figured the best way we could do it would do, be through a walking club. Um, and, and like I said, getting all of our kids involved, just chalking out a couple, couple slots throughout the week that all teachers can get all kids out uh, walking. So um, uh, it just kind of like fell into our lap and we, we felt the way to, found a way to create a schedule that was going to work. And I think, like I said, the kids have enjoyed it. Teachers, as you saw, teachers are out walking with their kids too, so they're enjoying it as well. So Sparky's the penguin that, uh, I don't know if you saw it out there, there's a little penguin. So every time the kids walk by it, it beeps it. So it's kind of like a race timer but it's just in a penguin backpack. So we call him Sparky, so everyone who's ever walking around with him has to walk around with Sparky. For the staff at this middle school, teaching students healthy habits is a labor of love. It just makes me happy. Um, I, obviously, we do everything here for our students. Um, students come first all the time. Um, and so it's, it, it makes us feel good to see our kids excited about um, going out and being physically active and, and hopefully changing some lifestyles that they might have been and making some better, healthier decisions than maybe what they've done in the past. So um, we're looking for the longevity of our students versus just the, the here and the now. So um, to see them build some type of healthy habits. It's real exciting. It makes us happy for sure.